So just a, a quick update. There's some weird stuff that happened uh, between last night and this morning. Um, uh, yesterday I didn't do a whole lot. I got I well I took all the uh, uh, the second load of donations down to uh, Goodwill and People's Church and uh, got back home, did some inside cleaning and things like that, but I got really, really tired really early, uh, went to bed and didn't end up doing a whole lot. Uh, this morning when I got up, the back door, the one that goes to outside, was open. I mean, the storm door was closed, but the actual door to outside was open, and I pretty sure that I closed it. Uh, I may have, I, I may have left it open, just been so zonked. Uh, and then this morning when I went to check the temperature, it was 30 degrees below zero. Um, <laughs> it's like, no. Uh, and my TV in the bedroom was on and I haven't had the TV in the bedroom on for quite a while. Um, so I'm not sure how that came on uh it was it had been in idle i guess and then when i uh when i asked the uh the home generic home assistant device a question <clears throat> the tv popped on i was like that that's really weird uh i haven't gone up upstairs and checked anything out yet i i don't think there's anything substantial out of place or what have you but um i'm mostly done with uh, the the stuff in closets and things upstairs so I'm getting into I think I'm going to try and get into the garage today um, not entirely sure I'm going to go put the heater on now because uh, it's still freaking cold uh, it's not 30 below zero anymore but it's still well below zero and that's just not something I want to hang around in <clears throat> But I'm trying to get some stuff done in the garage today, open up a little bit more space, maybe get to a point where I can actually put the uh, trailer hitch on the vehicle. So I'm going to check in later. <laughs> this is just, it's a crazy day. Back in a bit. All right, I've been doing a little bit of work in the garage. Uh, I had it heated up pretty good, but I think the heater, oh, well, it's a propane heater. And uh, I was not feeling particularly good out there, so I don't know if there was enough carbon dioxide built up. I do have a CO2 alarm out there, and it didn't go off or anything, but just to, uh, well, that and it's, it's a little overwhelming. <laughs> There's lots of stuff scattered out there. Uh, mostly I was able to kind of collect together the recyclables that are out there, some of the donation stuff I got loaded into the car uh, so I can make another donation trip. Uh, there's, you know, still room for a few more things, but it's mostly full. Uh, not going to go down today. It's already, you know, four in the afternoon. So, uh, other than that, I came inside to start going through, you know, Piper's groaning, going through some things, uh, going through books mostly. Um, I really want to try and find a place where I can donate some of these books. I mean, there are collections of of you know like time life books and other ones there's there's ones on sewing there's ones on gardening there are the you know the home repair and and home building series that i learned from if i can find places for those you know they're great otherwise they're just going to end up getting trashed and i hate to trash books you know it's just a thing but i don't know that i'm going to have a choice now, while I was going through the garage, making puppets come alive, <laughs> I, I figured that this one I would probably save. If nothing else, this may become a gift for some of my puppet folk. But uh, it's very. This is a very different kind of uh, puppetry than the ones that we're used to with TV TV. Uh, Anyway, quick update. Just wanted to uh, to check in. Books. Oh my God, books. Uh, today was a tough day. I uh, I took out all the recycling and moved it to the trailer. Um, that was actually relatively easy. 
uh, because the dogs were out playing with the frisbee and they were playing keep away from each other. So I, there was not a lot of my playing involved with that. There was a little bit because once in a while Isis would bring it back for me to throw, but I, it was mostly Isis keeping it away from Piper and Piper keeping it away from Isis and you know dog games. Um, the hard part was I had to pack a number of books into bags and put them in recycling. And these are, um, you know, hardcover books that I remember growing up and they're things that nobody would ever read again. You know, a number of them were easy, you know, like old, old uh, atlases and things like that. But some of them are, some of them are just hard. There's some that I, I think I'm keeping. Uh, I, I don't know if I am yet or not. There's, there's some that are, I don't know, I might see if there's any kind of collector value to them or if anybody would just take them as, you know, complete collections of things. that They're not things that I would ever use again. Uh, the tough one is going to be that, that encyclopedia collection because, I mean, that's the full encyclopedia set plus, you know, from 1959 and then all the annuals up through at least 2010. I mean, some of them are still in boxes. They've never been opened. Uh, I had a lot of copies of the Book of Knowledge. Anybody wants one of those, you let me know. Uh, but books are hard. Um, I don't know. There's, there's some that are just, you know, gems as I, as I find them. I'm, I'm putting them away and keeping them just because they're, they're freaking old. Uh, Started to go through some of the boxes uh, from the the basement. It's it's too cold outside to really do anything. I tried bringing a table in from out in the shed and uh, metal leg table, and I didn't have gloves on, and I just about got frostbite moving it from the shed just to the front door. I just managed to put on some gloves and bring it back inside. Now I'm going to let it warm up overnight. Uh, I don't know. It's cold. Everything's cold here. Uh, found the door open again. I, was, I think that was my fault. Um, but I mean, I, I was here and cognizant. I, I don't know if it was just that I forgot when I let the dogs in to shut the door, which seems odd twice. But yeah, I suppose that's okay. Uh, oh, coat hangers. Yes, wire coat hangers. I am saving the wire coat hangers. For those of you that are crafters or puppeters, you know why. There's a whole bunch of other other coat hangers that are here that are just fine for other things, and I'll probably end up donating those to you know, the Goodwill or something. Yeah, place that can use them. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to stop for the night or if I'm going to go hide up in one of the rooms and start going through paperwork or envelopes or something. There are things that I have yet to go through upstairs that I haven't touched. But you know, it's getting rid of books took a lot out of me. I, don't know. I haven't found all of them yet, certainly. but <laughs> There's a lot to do. And I don't want to do it, but I have to. So, yeah, some of the boxes back here are I started going through. Some of them I opened, and they're like full of different kinds of stuff, and I just don't have the energy to go into it tonight. So, all right, in the meantime, I will talk to you guys later. All right, Mom had a, a, a doll collection, or... I don't know if a collection is quite the right word, but she had a number of uh, number of odd dolls. Um, these are kind of cute. They're Barbie dolls that are intended as toilet paper roll holders. <laughs> so, you know, I figured, okay, we'll just set these up for now. I have no idea. 
I mean, these they are handmade and they're quite old. Another one. Uh, creepy stare. <laughs> Another one. I don't think quite quite as creepy, but uh, you know, suffice it to say, a doll sitting in a wicker chair, particularly a doll sitting in a wicker chair holding another doll. Ooh, creepy, creepy. Isis says creepy. Yeah, I know. <clears throat> Not creepy enough. You know, the dogs just started going bonkers upstairs. All right, show me. What is? What? What is? Show me. Show me. Show me. No, that's that's where the toys are. No. No, we're not going to go outside and play. It's too cold, sweetie. No. Uh, there's a bag of toys right here. And they want to go outside and play because we haven't had enough play outside today. Pains in the butt.